Good morning, everyone. Welcome to your weekday daily card reading from Spirit. I'm Jeanette Byro. I am a medium and a channeler. And let's dive in today on this amazing day today where we are going to celebrate this shift, this entry oh, into a new year. This is an exciting time. The energy is really powerful. It's, it's uh, alive and like sparking, sparking, but like a sparkler, not like a electrical circuit that's about to go haywire but more like those like birthday sparklers that just kind of fill you with awe and wonder when you look at them that's what i feel the energy is today so let's see what this the cards have in store to round out this week here hold on Oh, so interesting. Okay, and I'm gonna call or pull one clarifier. There's a deep theme in here. Okay, interesting. So my clarifier card is the wind fairy. This is all about change to me, change in the wind. This here says thoughts, words, intellectual analysis, but I'm really getting a big push that this is about change in the wind. Something is coming in and shifting things further. And here's the interesting thing. We have a theme. I'm gonna show you these all at the same time. Well, actually I'll do it this way. First card is perception, followed by burden, followed by focus. Now, this is what I love about this. Notice that each and every one of these cards is the forest. Okay. They're each in the forest. But here's the thing. Here's the key piece. Spirit is saying your perception, the way you choose to view things dictates whether you see it as a burden or a blessing. If you allow yourself to stay focused on your path, you're not going to get lost in the woods here. Like you see on the burden card, you're not going to get lost. You have the choice to either stay aligned with you or get lost in the woods. And that's completely your perception. Cause if I come back to this card, you can either be looking this way and seeing only trees and you're going to feel like you're lost. But if you turn around, you're going to see that there's an open path here for you. The choice is yours, what you wish to look at. You get to dictate that. So you completely are going to be controlling the reality that you live in based on your perception. That's a big piece. I'm pausing purposely. Life doesn't have to be the burden. If you feel you're lost, turn around and see what's behind you. Look behind you. Look to see where you can see the light to pull you through. And that is why they're saying, this focus card, stay focused on you, stay focused on your alignment. This came out earlier on this week. And I love that they're ending the week with this because it's saying, stay true to you. If there's anything you can pull from this moving into 2022 is stay true to your heart in a way that you do so with kindness and compassion. You can have firm boundaries, but stay true to your heart. Stay on your path. Your path matters. Your path matters. And that path, like I said, can either be open or totally blocked. It's up to you because both exist at the same time. That perception is yours. So I think that is a really interesting way to end the week. Um, Spirit's telling me to pull one more. So let me just see. Hold on. That was their message. They said they want to leave you with this. I love it. Two cards jumped out. Well, three cards actually funny. Okay. So they, they want, so that was the idea. And then they want to leave you with this trust your path. Okay. Trust your path, trust your heart, your focus. Remember recognize that if you stay in that energy of trust, you're protected with this protection card, you're safe. And if you stay in that energy, you can see this whole shift. And look at this. We're back at the forest again as birth and rebirth. 
How amazing is that? We are on the cusp of New Year's Eve here. We are, well, we are in that energy and it's all about this rebirth, this changing perspective. And look at this. When we move from this perspective card or perception here, right? You can choose to see this path or the forest. Look at how this one shows somebody. It's like they're coming out of the forest onto this clear path. They're getting back out onto here. So I think this is so great. I think this is such a beautiful blessing, surprise, last card from spirit to wrap it all up. See this as your time of rebirth. So I'll leave you guys with that. I think this is a beautiful, beautiful reading. Happy new year, everyone. I'm sending you all so much love and goodness. I hope you have a beautiful evening, whatever it is you do. And may you celebrate this renewal for you for 2022. I'm celebrating with you and let's all just put our best foot forward this year. So sending you much love. If you haven't already, please do subscribe and share. I truly appreciate you. And if you want to check out more content and insights, check out the Jeanette Biro podcast, as well as avalonspirit.com.